限界だ押すね今だ<笑>いややったぞ発動したぞ So guys, we're back. Um, we're gonna be going through it again, trying to get a dying's good ending. Don't know how to do that, but you know, we'll try. Obviously, you won't be seeing the same dialogue. I'll be skipping through that, so anything new you'll be seeing. Um, so let's just uh, jump into it. Continue your journey, Horizon. I woke, from an, uh, mm. I woke from uneasy dreams, looking at an unfamiliar scene. Just for a moment, I wondered where I was before the events of last night came back to me. After a good stretch, I looked all around the room, limited by the sunlight coming in from the window. Outside in the distance, the portal I had emerged from probably stood at the, on the peak of the hill, a small hill. Getting ready, I noticed something lying on the table. There's no from Remy. I don't think it's indeed anything. Okay, so this is the beginning. I thought it would have done some sooner. So, oh, my re my records indicate you have already experienced this section in a satisfactory manner. If you wish, we could skip sections like these which you have already agreed before. No need to read everything again. Isn't that great? How is this different than just using the skip but the button like control and tab, you may ask? Well, here's the deal. Using the skip buttons can be tedious, especially when encountering puzzles you've already solved before or when faced with long dialogue trees. Sometimes it's just easier to jump over a whole section, speeding it up, you know? So, during relevant sections, I will come in and ask you if you don't want to just outright jump ahead. Sound good, suppose? However, there are times when you might still want to choose. Well, so anyway, there are times when you might still want to choose not to jump ahead like this and use the skip buttons as usual. That's sort of fun. Both methods have their own advantages and disadvantages. Jumping ahead will often skip minor choices that can be made especially during character sections with lots of dialogue options. This can include parts that would unlock new achievements. However, jumping ahead will never skip important choices that you have to make, such as those that could result in a good endings or choices you made during your investigations. It's up to you whether you want to use it or not, but it might save you some time. My land choice is yours. Would you like to skip ahead? Um, I don't remember the beginning section. No, I do. Do I? I don't know. We'll just skip ahead. Because it's just the major stuff we need to do, right? As you wish. Oh, let's skip the head. So we're back to the apartment. I guess we're going to finish it. What? I was going back to the apartment. I guess there wasn't really much to do in the meantime. As I was spared, the more I was part of the investigation, maybe I should have thought about this. Bill, now I have a. After the bill. Um. Okay, so this is when you do this stuff. Okay, um, I guess the investigation went better than last time because I do not remember. Oh, what was that? I do not remember a meet with Sebastian. I guess we're not going to meet with Sebastian because we're trying to get a dime, right? Or is this a this is a major choice, right? But it's with a dime. Dang, I should have done some research in this. Don't fall. Okay. Alright. Um Wait, it was the first sorry, I'm just really trying to think. Because it's been so long since I did the investigation. So I think all I need to do, right, is just I think the main thing I skipped out on was just not investigating the park. Who knows? I don't know. Let's uh, get a dine again. Dine going. Dine deliveries at the cafe. 
It's quick. It's raining. Sad moments. It's a gang. It's, uh, Wow, I've only I could remember choices, right? Uh just hey. Skip. Long reverse and stuff, why don't come in? Do that. I get to give you guys into the scene in a satisfactory manner. Skip ahead. I guess so. I mean, I got the uh the, the um impressive. Right, so uh, number, number. So that should be... Neutral. Neutral! Motherfucker, what? So if you skip ahead, you can't get the, uh... The people. So... I guess we're going back in time. No, we're not. Oh, this is annoying. I should have done my research. This really sucks. Okay, well. Yet again. I guess I'll be... Another jump cut, because I have to go through everything again. Because I didn't make a save, so... Yeah. So guys, um... I just I decided I'm not going to use this skipping thing, because I think it just kind of skips over it and doesn't make any decisions. Um... Which isn't what we want. So I just be running through uh, this time i'm gonna be saying no i don't think this is like has any importance but we just see the dialogue um i don't know maybe make him trust us more so at the end he doesn't like i don't know kill everyone who knows i don't i don't know uh me neither i mean no you're not sebastian me neither i mean if i go now give him a body that's not the way be right sure I'm being hungry. Uh, wait, some breakfast, and then yeah, this, so uh, I guess jump cut. So guys, um, we're back. This is when um after the uh, uh he praises, you know gives you the letter and he used the lemon to find it. Um, I don't think this really impacts any. I'm just gonna say real quick. Um, I don't think this impacts anything major, but um, I don't know. Maybe there'll be a different dialogue here. I don't remember what I picked. I think I did that one, but. Uh, oh, what'd you expect, Razor? Yeah, wonderful, not you didn't. <clears throat> it's a good start. You can see I'm so good day with all the collision, and then you're back at home. Almost as if we are looking at a lot. Did a face of the entirety itself. For so long, you know, we thought we'd find an answer to it. Yet after all these years, we found we were all known the universe. It turns out we were not just looking in the right place. Okay, so I think that is just repeated dialogue so yep we're gonna be doing another skip all right guys we're uh, back here um i don't think too much is gonna change we're just gonna be going through this again except you know i'm handling the ropes i don't know i guess it's just a small check-in because it's for you it hasn't been any time for me it's been actually quite a bit wow i've already recorded for 20 minutes yeah so um Thinking back on this now, I don't think these will be getting out every Monday, Wednesday, Thursday because I'd be looks full. No, for this, for a dime and norm, it won't be because I've already gone through a huge amount of the dialogue. Everyone else, it will be because I have to read through the stuff. But for these next few episodes, it might take a while and not too much will change. So if you don't watch, that's fine. But yeah. So guys, uh, a little jump cut. So this is, you know, during a dines thingy. This is like at the end. Um, 
So you remember, if you remember last episode, yeah, last episode, how this choice actually did come into play. Like I, I said, uh, say my last goodbyes and hope for the best. Um, and that's what I did. I said my goodbyes and went back in time. I wonder if this actually influences the end, right? Because like I can stay inside and watch it all unfold. You know, like the meter coming down. Um, so. And there's also the bunker now that we know about. I think this is not really too much help, but um, uh, honestly, I don't think this. I mean, it's just for the ending, right? Now it's for the bad ending. So I'm gonna go with a different one for this, just to make it a bit more interesting, maybe. I think to get the like the 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 correct option, it is this one, but. It probably, status probably isn't updated yet because I haven't finished this. But, um, I don't know, I'm mostly going with the same choices I did last. I mostly, no, I have been doing with the same choices I had last time. So it sh should be good or flustered. I'm pretty sure it was after this. Um, but we're going to go with, I don't know, this one because I want to see the end of the world. But yeah, I don't know. Um, yeah, so you'll see another uh, jump cut, I guess. So, guys, this is another jump cut. We're back here again. Um, I said it didn't take long to get here, but I don't know. Um, I guess only with Sebastian. I, I think I met with him last time because I thought he was a dating path. But uh, I don't know. I mean, I, I got to Norm, but I, I'm pretty sure I didn't select him here, so. Um, why did I skip through that? I, if I don't think I've read this, then... You know what? Actually, hold up one second, jump cut. Alright, so I went back in earlier recordings. So, um, this actually isn't an option. This wasn't an option. So, I guess if you go through the game again, you actually get to date him, maybe? Uh, so obviously it's new dialogue, um, so I'll read through it. Obviously, we're not going to go for Sebastian. We're trying to get with a dime. And then if Sebastian is actually, actually is an option, then Sebastian, then Norm, then Bryce, and then I don't know, a toss between Remy, Remy and Anna. Probably one of them. <laughs> Stupid. Anyway, so, yep. Uh, Sebastian time. Hope you like a shitty Australian accent. Hey, Sebastian. This is rising. Huh. You just hung up. You're still here? I'll see on the clock, you know. Huh. Well, I'm glad you take my security so seriously. Just doing my job. <clears throat> Just doing my job, see. Don't come, sir. I appreciate it. Uh, I do appreciate it. This would make it more formal, right? I don't know. Safe scum to get Sebastian. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> um. I don't have water in here. Whatever. <sighs> Sorry. Hmm. So all my bad. Uh, just, I just actually haven't seen a human in the flesh for blood before today. So it's kind of all the tail. Don't worry about it. Actually, I just, you know, if you use a phone with me, yeah, that's what I meant. So, all right. Anyway, you need anything? It's just, uh, it's pretty boring when I have to spend all day on my own. I don't really know anyone here yet. So, I don't know where I could go or what fun or where I could go or what I could do for fun. Well, if it's if it were there, I could have shown you around town and given you a tour, but it's getting dark outside. And I think most places are close right now. Let me think. Oh, do you like being outdoors? Yeah, uh, yeah. Oh, me too. Oh, what, what do you think about camping? Wanna go camping right now? Well, might not be my list of you, but. I'm sure there's much less else we could do at this time. Uh, would it be okay for us to just go outside? I'm um, supposed to be gone here, you know. Uh, technically, I'm still on the clock, but camping would be much more fun than, <clears throat> than just you standing inside and me guarding your door, don't you think? Sods, I'm supposed to company wherever you go. You're not our prisoner, so of course, you're free to go wherever you want to. If you want to spend an outside experience of the countryside, not only it, not only could I not stop you, but I'll be obligated to come with you. See, what do you see? 
sell me up to sit here. So I'm guessing if you do this earlier, like if you don't go with the dying, and you do this earlier, you get a different place. I don't know. Sure, maybe got all my things. Where are we? Well, here we are. I'm surprised you even we even got this spot this late after what you told me. With a member of the police force and someone who is important as you are, it's not really surprising. They probably got probably got as an honor to be hosting this. So this is it. No tent or anything. Oh, tent tent comping would have been a bit more complicated to set up at the last minute. At last minute, is there any other form of camping? What seen here is cave camping. Simply, they just throw on a lot of costumes, but you sleep in caves for our this one. Well, oh, it's got some furnishing. Uh, could use a few sleeping bags though. If you want a comfort bed, it's just in your room. The, this here is a good idea. I'm just supposed to be on the ground, sounds great. Uh, yeah, I mean, you're supposed to sleep on the ground because they're dragons. But, see, this could be sarcastic, especially with that period. Uh, sarcasm, I like sarcasm. Not that these choices matter because I'm not going with you, sadly. But hopefully, you don't die at the end. That'd suck. That hurt even more than last time. Notifications, cool. Yep. Jeez, there's some new chits here. Uh, we even have some natural lighting in here. What? Yeah, we even have some natural lighting in here. So much for the real deal. We could just sit in the dark if you prefer that. No, I think so, do. Yeah, have you ever gone camping before? Not like this, plenty of times. Nope, this is my first. Uh, not like this. I'll see. You know, it's, I was kind of nervous when I met you for some. You can tell. It's what I think to hear that humans were gonna be all weird. But when I met you and you turned out to be just an ordinary person, I really, really, that really threw me off. You meet Razor before? I actually know everything about your visit is cloud and se se secrecy, not security. So I didn't get to hear much about Razor. I felt mad like before I met you. See? So, are you one of, are you the one who, of the, so are you one of those who expected me to act a certain way because I'm here? Actually, I didn't have much to do with it. Any high profile case would have to make me nervous, especially if I was in charge to keep them safe. I also happen to be the new scholar on the force, so I didn't exa exactly want this to turn into a career ending, a career ending right here. She could just saw it, don't worry about it, with the whole murder vest situation going on, you should be careful that and end more of this career, but I hope these walls don't cave in them. I like the top and bottom one. Bottom one's a joke. I like joke. If these walls start to crack, I'm not gonna be worried from without Markley. Good point. How long have you been on the force? Didn't they? They didn't assign a rookie to me, did they? Well, just because I'm scar doesn't mean I'm a rookie. It's been a few years now. I suppose that means you don't get many new recruits. Not here, at the very least. It's just a small town, so we don't really need them all that often. I got lucky when I got this position because I figured there'd be more competition from the locals. Locals? You don't live here? I live here now. Well, I actually grew up in a small farming village that most comes to stay up for runners like me. Runners? Hey, I'll show we call species sometimes. You've got pretty powerful legs. I can see that. You see a lot of things. Are there many villages where the inhabitants are mostly from of the same species? Well, sure. It's mostly smaller ones, today because the bigger they get, the more variety you'll find. I see. Even though, like, you say, I just rest. You say this is a small town, but every dragon we come across has been pretty unique, I'd say. Nope, never mind, that's a lie. That's a lie. The design looks unique. Their species actually is pretty interchangeable. No, but no, no, again. How they look? We're also playing to genetics, right? Mr. Bi you know, I was thinking this while going through this, right? The main character is a biologist. They set that up pretty heavy until after the first investigation. After the first investigation, you as a biologist no longer exist. You become dumb, dumb protagonist. Like, what's the whole purpose of saying I have a biology degree and hammering it in that you have a biology degree and then Never use that biology degree. <laughs> you know? I don't know. Oh, I have my hometown to compare, but from what I've heard, there are other villages that are fairly similar. They can only survive like that if they need 
if they need much, they want simpler dogs, or they they focus on a certain industry that space that species are good is good. That on certain industry that species is okay. I'm just dumb. That species is good at. Well, uh, so your species is good at farming. Better than Earth dragons, at least. Even though they come from come in handy for them vows. Dang, imagine your role in life is just to be an ox and you're sentient, but you're that's it. That's all you gotta do in life is pull up pull a cart. <laughs> well, why did you decide to become a police officer? I wanna see what it's like out there beyond our vegetable fields. And if whatever was out there is what I like the stories we I'd heard. Is it? Oh yes, it's been great. I mention it. I don't really know much about this town either. Well, what are talking to you? You tell me about the land, what you talk about like, your people. Um Alright, let's let's prove that Mr. Biologist or let's you know, work on your biology degree, Mr. Protag. Yeah, friendly bunch, for the most part. And of course I also meet some unpleasant fellows in my life, but luckily those seem to be the minority. It was also a bit of culture talk when our issue came here with all that. Different species they've been here together. I brought my police turn and took care of that. Can you tell me about the land? What is it like to work with Bryce? Uh, why is, why is it like, what is it like having so many different species on the force? Um, this is interesting. Command my hometown, it's been called cool. Mission Change. On the one hand, you get all kinds of different people with all kinds of different strengths, abilities, and backgrounds. That can make your work so much easier. On the other hand, it also creates all kinds of new problems that I never would have expected. I won't forget the first time I had to follow a shoplifter who also happened to be a flyer. Come on, land was like the price. Um, this one, so you know, just don't change the subject of the people when you're dating. It's kind of rude. The land, we all here they have fertile soil. No, that's fertile as my hometown, though. I was not talking about, uh, I was talking more about if they have any sort of industry. Oh, I'll see. Oh, uh, this town is actually quite unique because even though it's very small, it has its own production facility. With that, we basically have our own full production chain. So your one, so your one factory is everyone's pride and joy here. In a way, yes. Makes us very independent and keeps everything local. Guys, do you have any special recommendations or secrets I should know about this town? Secrets? Oh, this town doesn't have any secrets. No, not that I knew, but the very least. Uh, I know more than you because I come from the future. Uh, maybe you just don't belong in the inner circle yet. Uh, I think uh, as a new military police force, uh, that I got to see everything that isn't. <sighs> I think as a new military police force, I'd get to see everything that is to see. Either way, I don't think there's anything special about all time. Oh, okay, I guess I have to do it. Sad. He can't talk me on his wing. He doesn't have a wing when I came here. And I've been working with him ever since. But not until did. Oh, there it is. I think uh, it, I found it a bit weird that the big shot himself had to share the country pumpkin the rope still. There you are. Though he saw it as a challenge or... Though I thought he saw it as a challenge uh, or that he wanted to skip me away. Well, I'll say it's been great. If he age just him a lot. Yeah, but... But hey. Uh, I'm not the one he's been the... What are your impressions? Good, bad, ugly. Ah, uh, I like the reference. Uh, it's been fun so far. You kind of died, but you know, fun. Uh, it's not something I expected to say after I showed you a corpse on the face, dude. That did happen. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sebastian. I was thinking about the, uh, the past, but also the future. Because to me it's the past, but to you it's the future. So it's both. Don't you love time? Hey Bryce. Uh, oh, hey. If Bryce said, if I, hey, if Bryce said it had to be done, then that's probably the part of the job. Oh shit! Sure. It feels a good day. Idea. I'd like to take it to crime scene though. Oh, uh, no, he's a hands on guy, but he has to do a bit much for not intended. What pun? There's no pun. If you need my help, I'll be glad to give it. Fostering goodwill and all. Well, at least you don't seem to be traumatized by from your experience. 
Anyhow, uh, anyway, how about some fun? Well, what kind of fun are you talking about? How about some thing called a sample of our mock championship? See what we're playing. I saw a game called Bastion Breach. Never heard of it. Can't say I have. We often played in the big room, the past time. It's good fun. The A teams can't get quite heated sometimes. And we got over the lose. Sure. Okay. As you can see, each of us starts with all our cards. What we're going to see, we're in the hand. Ye diamonds. Ye diamonds, and I'll be hot. Okay. I'm assuming this, uh, uh, sorry, uh, this is his, right? This is mine. You're holding this in your hand. You know how much of a pain it is to hold more than 10 cards in your hand? And this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. That's a pain. That's an absolute pain. Of course, I've got my heart already. Stole those hearts to you. <laughs> uh, I bought these. Yeah, so, anyways. What I've seen this in is the middle row, which is a line of shift cards from the middle seat. This way, each game is <clears throat> each way each game is going to be unique since the middle row always changes between games. Now, this is how the game works. We will play around for each card in the middle row, starting with the one you see. Very deadly. During each round, we both side with a card to play and put it. They face down like this. Once we have both flip, once we have both played a card, we flip it over. Our card wins around, and whoever played gets a point. To clarify, to the lowest card and king's highest, the ace is special card. It beats every case card, but will lose our own any number card. Okay, get that. Uh, now the card from the middle also can't. It all scans, so it's possible that neither of us get the point for that round. If there's a tie, no matter. <clears throat> if there's a tie, no key went in between. No clear went in between the three cards or the middle as the highest card. No player would get a point for that round. However, right, next round, we'll give the winner an extra point to make up for it. At the end, the player with the most number of points wins the game. You get all that. Yep. Uh, it actually sounds pretty interesting. See, being with is all about bluffing in on games, so we can always see what we can always see what cards have been played, so each of us know knows exactly what the player has played. Or that or yeah. Sure. Don't worry, I'll go easy on you. Take all the time you need to make a selection. I like this. What does a Canadian flag? Are you actually Canadian? I can't do Canadian now since I said. Oh ah, you thought for the first card. It's an interesting thought. You could try to surpass it by playing something higher. But if you're going to do same, but if I'm going to do the same, you don't know how high I would go. Do not only beat the five, but your higher card as well. Also, on B, you could count on me trying to beat a higher card and play a low one. Instead, that's making me waste that mine. It's going to be here, I think. I suck this. Is. Okay. I probably suck this. Yeah. Um. Just play an ace right off the bat. <laughs> no, wait, that wouldn't win. <laughs> Alright. So. Oh, I'm stretching. Okay. I'm assuming he plays set cards each time. Again, this is my first time. I like this creepy chair. No, actually, I could be honest there. Um, so I'm assuming he plays set cards every time. Uh goal is to win so i am very stupid but i can normally i don't really, uh, no, i'm not going to strategy games all right so i'm assuming we don't get a card back like we did before he also took that one card which was a king i wasn't really looking at this card i don't remember so that's a five right a six would barely put me over, but if he goes anything higher than a six, I lose. But looking at what is out there, I might want to save the five near the end. Maybe play. No, because I want to. I want to look at the middle is where it's going to get interesting. The end is whatever. Um, hmm. 
So I play a six, and I don't. I need to play a seven or eight or nine or ten for the six and the ten. The ten's gonna be interesting. The eight. So, uh, hmm. I play a nine and then botch the king. And then win, and then play a eight for the six, and then a joker for the ten, and then a nine for the eight. That's kind of pushing it, though. That's really pushing it. Shit. I don't know. If I can sweep the end, I'll be fine. Okay. Well, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do seven. We're gonna botch, and we're gonna go eight, and then maybe botch, and then win that. All right. I think I got it. I was gonna see. I'll just play those two just to see what would happen. You didn't know your point, and it didn't. Then it's easy. It's just as important as analyzing potential moves. It's all these. First one's yours, but now I have to ask you, was it worth it? Yes, it was, because I don't I really have anything to be the king. So, being king presents with an on our job, especially when getting in. Already, when most calls are still unavailable. I already figured this one out though. Oh, I could tie it. Good tight, but I said I wanted to botch this. That's a good star. Of course, the only cards. This king is nice, but not playing the card. Here would be a rookie mistake. It's definitely a safe play to just get rid of the little card. You read my mind. Oh, I like you. I like it. I like it. All right, and then I said I was going to play the eight, and then I'm going to go queen for the ten. Damn. My point. All right. Hmm. I have, to, I have to botch the ace. No doubt about that. So, is he going to go low? Is he going to go high? I kind of want to win this point, but it's going to kind of screw me over for the next few. So maybe I should botch this and then try to win the next. But I also want to win at the end because that's where a bunch of low cards are. Hmm. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to win. I want to win these two. And I can botch those three and then just... Yeah, yeah, that's what I want to do. But to botch them, I have to play high cards. Fuck. No, because I have low cards. And then I have high cards there. So, an ace will lose. A king will win. Unless he's a king. No, he's played as king. He's played as king. So he has two, three. So he has a four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Joker baby, queen, and an ace. So, if I play a Joker baby, and then a 10, okay, you play this 10. What if he does a queen? Screw it. Uh, let's, go, let's go queen, and then to queen, then 10. Oh, you son of a fucking bitch. Don't worry, he's to get win. Oh, no, not if I win this. Hmm. Okay. And then I'll say that I was going to play with a 10, right? Because he doesn't have a 10. But, no, he doesn't have a queen either. But if he plays a joker, baby, then he will win. But what if he plays the joker at the ace? Right? Hmm. <laughs> I need to botch those three, and then I can just come in for a sweep at the end. No, I, no, I need to play an ace at that queen, and then I'll get that point. Because I'll be nine. Because when she has it, oh, fuck. Monkey plays an ace there. I can play a nine. That's a nine. Okay, so he has a joker. Right, he has. Well, just King Queen here. He has an ace. But he's going to play those on the face cards because it's the only one he can win. Question is which one is he going to play it on? Can you play the ace on the one? I want to play the ace on I want to win this one. And then I want to botch the ace. And then I want to 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 Okay. Um, let's go up to 10. Son of a bitch. Okay. I said I was going to botch this one. The only one's going to be three at the end. Oh! Huh. 
Okay. Well, fuck no, because... Fuck. So I want to botch this one. Shut the fuck up, dude. I'm winning. And then... Is he going to play... I can king dash, but if he plays an ace, he wins. Shit. No, because it'd be smart for him to go ace on the queen. Right? Shit, this isn't gonna be a queen sweeper. Fuck, what does he have? He has a two. Three. King, queen, jack, nine, four, eight, four, five, six. Okay, what's that? The only thing I can beat these two is his ace, which is so hard. Oh, and I have four, five, six, seven, eight. It's one point one there. Uh, oh. That's disgusting. I think he hates me right now. Shit. She's not going to play me. Fuck, 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 fuck. Still in that one. You know, we're fine. Shit, 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 shit. We played the ace now. I take the queen, but if he doesn't play the ace now, that's just. Shit. Are you gonna play the ace or are you not gonna play the ace? You're gonna play the ace or are you not gonna play the ace? Are you gonna play the ace? I wanna do a king and then an ace. But I feel like he's gonna play the ace. So if he's gonna play the ace, then how helpful is a six? Is six when he goes to three? No reason not to. Fuck, 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 fuck. Unless I tie it. I don't, cause you can't tie it here. I cannot tie it. You're gonna watch this and do an ace, or you're gonna do an ace and then watch the next one. <laughs> Fuck it, the phone, you're telling me what I should do. Do I toss the ace or not? I'll toss the ace. That's not a flip. Come on. No, eraser. You. Am I doing the ace or am I not doing the ace? You're still not flipping. Flip. God damn you, flip. Fucking hell. Shh. Fuck this, dude. Son of a bitch. King the knife. King the fucking knife. Son of a bitch. I'm gonna beat you. Son of a fucking bitch. I'm gonna beat you. Yeah, you know, fucking bitch. Okay. Four, four, okay. Four, one, two, three, four. One, two. So I forget this. I can tie it. I have to win this if I can, I can tie it. What do you have? He has two, three, five, six, seven, eight. And then a queen. You son of a bitch. You son of a fucking bitch. You're gonna play that fucking queen card, you son of a fucking bitch. Shit, 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 shit. Shit. If I play the Joker and he plays the queen, I fucking lose. I lose a Joker and then I know I'm kind of screwed at the end. I really screwed at the end. Oh, I should fuck that. If I would've got that fucking ace, I would've fucking won. God damn it. Son of a bitch. <sighs> Play any of these because he has greater fuck. But I need them to win here. Fuck. Okay, if if I do the nine, then Joker, and then but okay, so let's go. I want to win this, but I don't. Where's he gonna play the Joker? The, the Queen. So if I go Joker, and then nine, and then five, and I have, I have to botch that, and then six there. That's what we're gonna do. I hate you. I hate you so much. I'm going to literally kill you, dude. I'm going to let you die. I'm going to let Sebastian kill you because... Not Sebastian, Reza. I'm not going to let you kill yourself. That's stupid. So, well, I, pff, this game's fucking botched. God damn it. Fuck, you just had to win that fucking ace. You son of a fucking bitch. Oops. Anyway. Let's just... Well, this will... Give me the point, but it doesn't fucking matter anymore. Some fucking bitch. <sighs> what can I do? Not literally nothing, so I might as well just play down the row. No, remember, oh, it's fuck. So I can get that if I save this six, maybe. So just go five, four, six. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, you know what's over, dude. Whatever. 
Oh look, a tie. <laughs> oh, son. Alright, see, it's what you asked. Yeah, no, just don't worry, I'm gonna cheat next time. Oh, okay, so I can't help it. You just that good. Beat someone who's played for the first time ever. Congratulations. I don't be possible now. Maybe I'll win next time. Oh, I will. Son of a fucking bitch. If there's ever such a thing, I'll, I'll just put these away. No rematch? Oh, wait, it's more time. It's getting late now. If you say so. Yeah, you know, you know I have time powers, huh? Huh? I maybe never saw a mark. You can teach me a human card game. I don't know any many card games, uh, sure. I don't know many card games, but sure. Oh my, we can get some of sleep now. Oh my, and it can't be. It, it'll be just as busy as tomorrow as it was today. So I'll not forget. I will not forget after. Get up with really all about this. Yes, you would have to. So, how do I get the rocks? It's right. It's pretty cold. I suppose it takes some getting used to. I might go to the nice at the very least. I can warm you up. Not sure if it would be safe to keep a fire burning overnight. You are. Well, it's not about that. I see. Either way, the old bike can't park an office myself. I'll take it. All right then. Is that better? Sure. 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 He's cuddling up with you, okay? Sure. <laughs> ah, well. Hey, got the duty card again. Anyway, so. This episode is, wow, that long. Okay, well, obviously for you it won't be that long. For me, this is going to be a bitch to edit. But anyway, um, next time we'll speed run through this more. I guess you'll see me run with Sebastian. I wasn't planning on running with anyone, but I can't resist my boy Sebastian. So, yeah. Um, editing time, yay.